So here it is, the Black Forest, or the Schwarzwald as it's called in German. We are actually in the southern part of the Black Forest. We're at the highest point, which is known as the Feldberg. We've taken the ski lift up to here. It's taken us about seven minutes. You can see this is the viewing platform, but you have this beautiful view. It's now the 20, 20th of October 2011. And just yesterday we had snow for most of the day through the Black Forest. And it's left us with this lovely peppered carpet of snow, uh, which is also hanging on the branches of the pine trees. So the Black Forest was actually formed oh, many millions of years ago with the folding of the land as the African continent pushed up towards Europe. It's actually the lower, it's part of the lower section of the Alps. The Alps sit behind us about a hundred kilometres or so. But this folding took place millions of years ago. The Romans wouldn't even come through the Black Forest as they were scared of the potential threat of tribes that lived in the forest and also as well as that just of spirits and other items of which they had no knowledge or education about. So anyway, you can see this area where we're looking towards now, as you can see the sun has been on it through the day, so the snow has melted. You can see some of the more shaded areas, especially at the higher altitude. This is the actual where the Berg Barn or the mountain cable car takes departs from. So just looking down towards the Feldberg Barn, as it's known. And then behind us is the Cairn, which marks the high point, or one of the high points of the mountain. You can see the cable cars coming up now, the top cable car station, and as we said you have the can here on the very top of the uh, mountain, or should we say one of the parts of the top of the mountain. Over here you also have the Feldberg Turm, which is a viewing platform. So you can uh, in fact ascend this between 9 o'clock and 4.30, apart from when the fellows may be having lunch. There's little uh, binoculars here which you can have a look deeper into the forest and as well as that they have uh, signboards here as well which explain a little bit about some of the different areas which you can see and also as well as that has the names of the various mountains that you are in fact uh, looking towards. So literally it is wrapped all the way around and on a clear day you can actually see right into the Swiss Alps so to give you a little bit of an idea you can see here Mount Titlis which is about an hour's drive from Luzerne and then as well as that you have the Monch, the Jungfrau so these are all mountains which on a clear day you could see from this area where I'm standing now so once again, we're talking about, and you can actually see very basic outline, but very, very far off in the distance. But to give you a little idea, you're looking in this direction here at the moment. So right off, way, way, way off. So what we're looking at at the moment, this is what's called the Speishorn. So you can see this uh, circular mountain just behind the ski lift pole. This is what they call the uh, Speishorn. 1350 meters above sea level so you would literally be looking directly above pretty well that point which is the very center of the screen now so anyway we're on our way to Zurich now make our uh, journey down towards Switzerland and that's it farewell from the Feldberg <laughs>